happy Teacher's Day for all the teachers. Presented as 10. So you didn't get me? Same as the uh, other side. So let's go to an example to show you how to work this. We're going to take 7 times 8 as an example. 7 times 8 equals 2. You don't know. Let's see. So first we're going to count the bottom fingers which is plus and then we're going to move to the upper finger which is times so let's do it so here i have my hand the stinky finger is six as i told you so we grab seven and then we grab eight we rotate them and then we look to the bottom side which is plus so 2 plus 3 equals to 5 so we got the first digit which is 5 and then we move to the other side to the uh, bigger side which is times so 3 times 2 which is so we got our last digit and this is the answer, 56. Still didn't get me, you will have another chance to understand more. So we will go to another example which is 9 times 7. So equals 2, we don't know. So let's see. So first we're going to count the bottom one, which is plus. And then we're going to count the upper one, which is times. So let's do it. So we got them ready. So we go to the bottom one. Four plus two, which is six. So we got the first digit, 6. So, we will move to the next digit. digit. 1 times 3, which is 3. So, 3. So, this is our final answer. Guys, this is way too that I think will be more easier for you. So what we have to do is we have to think that the bottom part is in the tenth place and we add it. And the top part in the ones, ones place and we times it. Let me, I'm going to show you an example. Example, six times six. So equals two. We don't know. We're going to find out. So, the, the pinky finger is 6. So, we have to put them together. We have to rotate them and put them together. So, 6 times 6. So, I said we have to count the, the, uh, the down fingers as 10th place. So, 10, 20. And then, we go to the upper part. We have to times it. So, 4 times 4 which is 16 so 20 plus 16 is equal to 36 here we go we got the answer the answer will be 
36. So I'm going to give you another example which is 9 times 9 equals 2. Let's see what the answer will be. So we're going to put our hands together like this and then we have to count it as 10th place. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. So we put that 80 there and then we're going to count the upper part. 1 times 1 equals to 1. So then we're going to add 80 plus 1 equals to 81. Here we go. We got our quotient 81. Don't forget to subscribe my videos and leave a like if you like this video and click that notification bell so that you won't miss any of the videos that I upload next time.